Hey Capricorn, welcome to my channel. This is going to be a love reading for the sign of Capricorn. So if you are a Capricorn Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, North Node or if you have a stellium in Capricorn, this reading is going to be for you. Keep in mind, this is going to be a general reading so it might not resonate with everyone. If it doesn't, let it fly. Don't try to force the message. Also, don't let this reading take anything from you. And lastly, do consider subscribing to my channel. That way it will help me to tap into your energy for future readings. Okay. Someone's thinking about you, someone's missing you, missing the long talks and conversations, the bantering. Someone is thinking of communicating with you. Expect some sort of communication from this person, especially if it has been long that there is no contact between the both of you. Expect some communication from this person. If there has been ego wars between you and this person in the past, then this person is thinking of letting go of their ego and talking to you. Just let me pick up the cards. Finances and career. This person has a very, very strong sexual attraction to you. Like they're very sexually attracted to you, very strong physical attraction. This person, uh, if you guys were sexting in the past, this person really misses that. So be careful that if you're looking for love, if you're looking for commitment, if you're looking for a relationship, then be careful about this person communicating with you. It, it is very possible that this is the Knight of Wands, King of Wands energy who just misses the good fun times that you had together. Oh, okay. Soulmates. So there's love and attraction. All right, as I was saying that this person could be physically attracted to you with the soulmates card here. Yeah, it's more than lust. It's more than just some fun, just some fling. This person misses you. If in the past this was just a fun sexual kind of connection, then this person misses the energy that you both shared together. The distance might have made this person really miss you, think about you, think about this connection and that is when they understood what this connection meant to you. They realized that it is just not something physical, it's more than that. They love you too. Six of Cups and Ace of Pentacles here. Soulmate connection. Someone who's a soulmate to you. Six of Cups is a past connection. Could be this could be a past life person too. Okay. I also saw the five of pentacles, so definitely finances have been a issue between the both of you. You could be you people could be at a distance right now and Somebody wants to travel towards you, but because of their finances, because they were too focused on their career, because they had to sort those things out in the past, they couldn't really. Yeah, but this is probably the kind, the person who has realized your value, who has realized they want you and they want to come after you. Someone who has just realized that this is not just a physical connection, they are in love with you too. They see a future with you. They see a connection with you. Bottom of the deck is the Emperor. So Aries energy. This person is 
really working hard to be independent it could be your energy too you are really really working hard very focused on your career right now capricorn you are a hard working sign and you do as an earth sign pentacles are your thing you like to be independent you like to be stable it is very possible that you are working very hard right now towards your finances and career Yeah, page of pentacles. Communication. Someone wants to let go of the past, let go of whatever happened in the past and communicate with you. Page of pentacles is a slow moving energy. But they are very loyal, very stable. You or this other person could have blocked each other on social media. And now this person is thinking about communicating with you. See again, bottom of the deck is Ace of Pentacles. This reading talks about someone wanting another chance with you. Someone wanting to build with you. Not just another chance, not just lust and a physical attraction and a fling or an affair. But someone who wants the Ten of Pentacles kind of energy. The Knight of Pentacles is bringing this Ace of Pentacles towards you so that you can build together something, a foundation. Yeah. If you have blocked this person in the past or this person blocked you on social media in the past, then this person is thinking about traveling towards you. Earth sign here, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, another Earth sign. Four of Wands. Ooh. And Temperance. So a lot of happiness, a foundation. As I was saying, this person wants foundation with you. They want to build a foundation. Four of Wands talk about talks about happy times, having fun together. And not just fun, like having a solid bond together too. The Four of Wands is also the 11-11 card. So this person could be trying for a while to be patient and manifest you. If there has been a gap between the both of you, a no communication, no contact situation between the both of you for long, this person is thinking of communicating with you. They have been very patient. They have tried to balance themselves out so that they can bring in this communication. Yeah, they are very attracted to you. The bottom of the deck is Ace of Wands here. Ace of Wands again talks about new beginning. So we did see the Ace of Pentacles and now we saw the Ace of Wands. We want a new beginning with you. Sagittarius here. Yeah, finances and career was a big focus in the past. It is possible that because of uh, because of your finances and career, you could have been too focused on work, or this person was already working on something, and they felt like they couldn't give you the time, the energy you needed. A relationship needed okay there was definitely some financial issues in the past and you both have been trying to work hard on it separately in the eight of pentacles this is also a very very hard working person someone who puts in a lot of effort into what they are doing 
so even if they want a connection with you this is the kind of person who will put in the effort towards that connection they won't be the kind of they aren't the kind of person who will expect you to do all the work but in the past there was definitely some financial issues between the both of you this is just the kind of person who was focused on their finances a lot because they wanted to prove something they were busy proving a point it could be just they wanted success first before they could have some strong foundation some strong relationship with the person with you it is also possible that this person because their finances weren't right they had this concept in their mind that you wouldn't accept them to turn in their favor finally this person might be feeling that finally they have enough to give you this ace of pentacles if they were working hard on building something this person might feel like they have finally built it and now they can approach you the 10 of wands this person was in a very heavy energy in the past it is very possible that in the past this person thought relationships to be just hard work and they were not ready to put in the hard work in relationships they had a lot of insecurities when it came to relationships whatever past experiences this person had that led to them not thinking about relationships seriously not taking relationships seriously again as i said at the beginning of the reading i got this knight of wands energy and the bottom of the deck was knight of wands the knight of wands and the page of wands Yeah this person in the past was very very just in this fiery kind of energy they just wanted to have some fun they just wanted to have flings they were too focused focused on the career and that is what why they didn't want anything serious from you but eventually they met you they fell in love with you they couldn't help but fall in love with you they couldn't help but feel this bond with you and now they are really working hard and then this person thought that they need to work hard on their on their career and then they can approach you so it is very possible this person had a player kind of energy in the past who was who just had wanted to have some fun in the like in the side while they put all their effort and focus into work but something happened which made this person feel like you were a true match to them and that is why they worked hard towards this connection they worked hard on building themselves up you could be dealing with a sagittarius here of wands eight of swords yeah this person wanted a new beginning in the past they wanted a new beginning but they had to choose the bottom of the deck is two of wands they had to choose between 
the career and you and they chose their career this person could be a lot in their head right now they are thinking they are overthinking they might be in this mood of they don't know whether you're going to accept them back or not because you chose career over because they chose career over you at some point in the past but now they want to choose love here the king of cups and the two of wands in the past if they chose career if they chose working on themselves if also they chose just being in this player like energy and keep focusing on the career then this person now wants to choose you they now want to choose love over career over anything else over even having fun because look at this the knight of cups the queen of wands because they really really like you they have feelings for you they found you as the perfect match almost yeah this person was selfish in the past they couldn't even make a decision two of swords they couldn't even make a decision properly they could have taken their time to make a decision and you decided to move on you decided to focus on yourself much rather the sun they want happiness this person really really wants happiness right now and they see that happiness with you the king of wands they want to pursue you this person is really looking forward to being with you person put you in a third party situation and chose someone else over you then that was just because it would look good good on papers and definitely get that feeling that they chose someone who would look good on papers in the past but now they want to choose you now they want to pursue you choose love queen of pentacles they see you as someone with whom they can build the queen of pentacles is a very nurturing loving caring energy and the queen of pentacles is someone with whom you build this 10 of pentacles so now they are thinking about building this empire this legacy with you and that is why they want to approach you with this nine of knight of pentacles energy because this you as this queen of pentacles this is definitely the kind of person who was being very fiery very passionate and they're all about having fun and doing their own shit while taking care of the career you know the kind of person who is very very focused on the career and other than career they don't care about anything they almost have this player who looks good does good in life has a very stable career is doing very well very focused on their career and they don't want anything to do with relationships or love but then they meet you may sorry then they meet you and then this person sees you as the queen of pentacles they finally realize they want someone by their side to build a legacy this is could be the kind of person who is realizing that they are done with being this king of wands this fiery passionate only player kind of energy going after things they wanted in the past and now they want to be in the queen of pentacles and it, sorry now they want to be with the queen of pentacles they want to build with someone 
so in the past this person was all about being in this king of wands energy but now they want to build with someone they want to build with you with this queen of pentacles with the temperance and the queen of pentacles here this person has learned to be patient when it comes to connections when it comes to relationships they are done with this wand energy of always you know fire 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 going after things that you want and having fun not settling down this person is ready to settle down with you they are stalking you they want to communicate with you the knight of pentacles the knight of swords this person is looking forward to communicating with you and look at that the three of wands and the ten of pentacles they want to build with you whatever happened in the past this person wants to let it go they want to change they have changed themselves definitely this is the kind of person who has worked on themselves and now they are looking to build with you the 10 of pentacles is all about building the knight of pentacles wants to build with this queen of pentacles towards this 10 of pentacles okay the 6 of pentacles in this deck has this cute little uh, almost like exchanging a letter so communication This person could be really really thinking hard about how to approach you right now. pentacles and the ten of cups yeah the queen of pentacles ten of cups they see you as a wish fulfillment seven of pentacles the ten of pentacles they want to work hard they're really really thinking about building something with you okay also the ten of cups this person sees you as the wish fulfillment right now so this person feels like you are the one who's going to complete them as much as mushy as it sounds this is what this person is and look at this the knight of cups as i said they see you as someone who will complete them the knight of cups this person is really really romanticizing about you right now yeah as and um, look at that the passion the obsession they are romanticizing about you because they want to approach you they want to come towards you yeah justice they want to balance the scales whatever imbalance was there in the past whatever wrong this person did they want to make it right they want to make it right with you the 
could be dealing with a Libra here. They are coming towards you with justice. They want to make things right. And they are very, very romanticizing about you right now. Daydreaming about you almost. You know, daydreaming about a future with you. of wands your advice is here is to focus on your stability as i said you are a very hard working sign capricorn so if you're focused on your stability if you're focused on your career if you're going after things that you want and you are in this queen of wands energy right now yeah king of swords queen of wands keep being this energy this person will be attracted to you because of this energy Whatever energy you are in right now, you are all about, see, the nine of cups again. You are all about taking care of yourself right now. Keep taking care of yourself. Keep going after things that you want, whatever it is. And when this person approaches you, be very as logical as possible. Make sure that whatever happened in the past with this person, however they treated you, they don't get that opportunity to treat you again. Although I see that this person has changed. But you need to be in this King of Swords energy so that no one can bullshit you. It is also possible this person right now sees you as this King of Swords energy. Okay. And that is why they want to come to you, right? You're trying too hard. Give it time. Wait. Yeah. Don't rush into it. Allow nature to take its course. Everything happens in divine timing and not when we want it. Okay. So divine timing is definitely at play here. And as I said, this person has a lot of passion for you. You both have a lot of passion for each other. You are a very passionate person. As I can see from here. So in the past, if you have rushed into something, you need to slow down right now. When it comes to relationship, when it comes to connection. Okay, let's see what we need. Surrender unhealthy relationships. Let go of relationships that don't serve you, including unavailable or toxic people. You deserve to be treasured by others and to be surrounded by positive people. That is why I said you need to be in this King of Swords energy. Also with this surrender to non-action, if you're working too hard on something and you haven't taken a break in a while, this talks about taking some break, okay? You could be experiencing some burnout soon in the future or in the present. You need to take a break right now if you're working too hard. If you haven't taken a break in a while, you need to. All right, Capricorn. Well, that's your reading. I hope you find the clarity you've been looking for. I'll see you guys in your next reading. Until then, take care, guys. Bye-bye.